Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play some more Anarchy Online. So we are back, and uh, I there was this NPC. We've talked to him before. I kind of derped up. I was looking to buy weapons. He didn't have anything here, but he actually teaches you how to upgrade your weapons. So we can go in here and say, okay, we want to do dagger, obviously. And uh, there you go, assembly. So what we have to do here. So it tells you what you need. You're going to have to buy his little thing here, unless he gave you another one, because I think we... Yeah, here you go. So the adaption factory. So there you go. So we need to get these guys, which I'm pretty sure we got them. Yeah, combine the samples. Oh, can you actually click these? Oh, they just show what it is. Okay. So I'm pretty sure to create a venom cartridge, blah, blah, blah. So these were the guys with the fluids or whatever that was gross sounding. Um, so that shouldn't be a problem. And then it'll create these injected daggers. So I don't know if they're, I guess they're a bit better. Six to 23. Okay, yeah, that definitely is uh, better damage. Min damage is increased, max damage is increased. So my understanding, and you don't quote me on this at all, the fleas, the garbage fleas, as far as I know, I think they're the ones that drop the, uh, the venom. Uh, I'm hoping so we're gonna go and kill these poor guys who are gray and We'll spend more time waiting for the loot than actually killing them probably Did we kill this guy I feel like we did at one point I wasn't sure if he was the one I know we struggled with one of these guys at one point So it's like one of those things where it's like oh, I'm not sure I feel like I've earned my right to kick his ass <laughs> Can I do that on him? Nope, didn't work in time. Okay, let's do this. So you got your things here. I don't think there's anything I really care about at this point, but uh, it feels good to just kill him. And then the loot's there for somebody else. To... That's the thing. Like I would normally not leave loot to rot because it takes longer to respawn or whatever, but I think more people would love the loot than they would love to try to kill it if they couldn't kill it, right? I actually got that to proc. I wonder if this makes them lower level or not. So garbage fleas. Yeah, we need garbage fleas. Did you do this, buddy? I need bloody fleas. Okay, I'll do this for a while because this might take a while. Especially if I'm an idiot and picking the wrong ones. I think I'm right, but uh, I'll take care of this for a bit. I want to try to get two of them for both daggers and then we'll upgrade them and see uh, what goes on. Gum. Okay. So let's see here. Uh, we can go and open this up. I guess you just take these guys out. And then shift T was it. So we're going to put... I'm not sure how this works. I guess you put this in first. Then this. Yeah, there you go. And then we're going to do that again. You here. And... Oh, no. Is it a one time? So freaking rude. Uh, let's go get another one. And then I want to get both of them done at the same time, right? But that is so freaking rude. I think it's a one-time... Uh... I don't know if that was the case before. I feel like it wasn't, but maybe I'm wrong. It's been so long. I honestly thought it had its own interface a long time ago, but I have no clue. Like, it was... This is... We're, we're talking about a device that was used, like, a decade ago kind of thing. So, it's like... I have no clue anymore. But anyways, we can buy more. That's not a problem. Uh, I feel like this guy... I remember him even being in um, Shadowlands for some reason. But, eh, whatever. Anyway, so we're going to do that again. So, we're going to put this in here. And we're going to put this in here. There you go. And build... There you have it. And then we're just putting these guys in here. So we're going to put this guy in here and this guy in here. Uh, let's try that again. Let's see if is it you and then you. Aha, there you go. So build. So there you go. So if you look at this, 3 to 18, 6 to 23. So that's pretty badass. Very cool. I wonder if piercing is any different. I guess there was no requirements for the one, right? Yeah. DPS 3 to 11.5, DPS 1.5 to, yeah, okay. So it's not going to be like the ultimate, you know, thing, but it should be a lot better. So put you in there and then you in there and build. Okay. And there we have it. 
we should do a little bit more oomph against the aliens and making our lives better. And then uh, I might as well head over to those aliens now too. Uh, let's see here. I get rid of this and this. And modify uh, strength. You might want this for a buff reasons, basically. I think this stuff is kind of useless. I think this is like later on you need this for other things that you can use, but I don't think it's going to be much useful here right now. I have no clue what this one is. No, uh, universal. We'll just keep it for now. And uh, then, oh yeah, I got these rings here. I wasn't sure what I was going to do with them. Because I think we already have the one here. Yeah, so cold damage and stuff. Cold and fire. So we already have that. And this is all defense. And this is chemical radiation and poisoning. But I assume stacking one is better, I'd assume. Anyways, I think we're going to fight some aliens. Apparently, this guy has a side quest for us, the Demsman guy. This is the one where we put the uh, little listening bug on before, so let's see what he has here. It's something to do with the protesters. Yeah, here you go. Where's the Bronto? So what we're going to do is, I think, get him a Bronto burger, probably. Buy and give a Bronto burger to Desmond. Okay. And there was the little Bronto stand here, right? So we'll see how well this works. by you um bronto burger i guess yeah i mean i'd assume it'd be something else but i mean that's blue i guess hey, did i buy it yeah i did i thought that was just like an item like to put in your hand but maybe it's also the food one <laughs> or it works as both right Okay, so we'll give him this. Looks like we did it. Okay, rally. Okay, mission. Eliminate two protesters. <laughs> Not going to get those on there, am I? Well, that's one protester done. Oh, wow, you are dramatically death slow. Okay, you know what? Screw you. Apparently there's a bodyguard here, and that bodyguard is very tough. There you go. Oh no, we're oh no, oh you're not using the you're using the last time, okay. Shh, that cool wet work. Objective terminate uh, okay, let's do that. Cedric Harding. That's just right around here. Actually. Oh, right here. I was like, uh-oh. Please don't be the Bronto guy. <laughs> he gives good burgers. <laughs> Wait, is that it? I guess that's it. Yeah, that's... <laughs> that's how it ends, is just murder the guy and you're done. That's funny. I guess it gives you a bunch of EXP too, right? But let me just double check here. Uh, overview, kill him. There's a, okay, yeah, that's it. Okay, so we did the we're gonna, we did the upgrading the weapons, which is awesome. Um, there was nothing for PvP for us to do because no one was there. The shiny elite we did, the shade guy, uh, food stuff we did, right? That was the farm or whatever. The credit card, yeah. So outside of choosing a faction. Leave for a drama, enter the hill. Okay, so there's a, a special delivery, apparently, as well. Um, but that's get the package from Janos. Leave landing for a drama, enter the hill deck in the tower and telepad. Okay, so we'll do that after. So basically, aliens. That is all that's left to do. So I'm going to head over to the aliens. We're going to kick some alien butt. And then uh, that's it for this place. We're back with the aliens. Unfortunately, the aliens are going to get their asses handed to them. Extremely crazy. Oh. 
Harvey the bully. We have to stop him. So Harvey the bully actually hurts his own kind. I wish I had it on film. This was in between episodes, but uh, yeah, he was picking up his picking on his own kind and actually trying to kill them. And I thought, oh damn, that is so mean. But I guess that's why they call him Harvey the bully because he's a bully to his own people. <laughs> Uh, I, f- I think that's adorable. It's also mean, but it's adorable. But yeah, we're going to kill some of these alien guys. Hopefully we can kick butt on the bigger guys now. Um, I mean, there's not much more we can do. We got upgraded weapons. We're level 15. We're, we're, we're basically as good as we're going to get, you know. So um, hopefully we don't do so bad. Actually, you know what? We're not as good as we got. I still have to. Work on my armor. I guess we should do that now, to be fair. Look at all this stuff. I like grabbing these sometimes. I, I feel like they might be worth something, but... Oh, that's... It's just a suit, but... An Omni. Oh, okay. And you have tokens for it. Um, but yeah, so let's see here. Um, let's just do these one at a time, because they're, they're a pain if you don't. There you go. I just thought maybe we should upgrade these right now because we haven't done them quite regularly since we actually got it, to be fair. Which is not a big deal. You don't have to do it every second kind of thing, but I think at this point we're ready to do some upgrades here. Perfect. Okay, I think that's good there. And then what else did I want to do? Oh, yes, you. So let's do... I haven't done these for a bit too, so I might as well level these up. I went to nano pool, which is crazy. You're gonna want to put some in nano pool, but I'm just right now we don't have to do anything in there, so I just ignored it for now. But that's not something you can just get away with. I want to let you know that right away. You're gonna have to dump some in there eventually. So, and we're only putting some in the the nano skills when I need it at this point. So that's okay. First aid has been kicking ass for us. Computer lit. There you go. So save and close. And uh, maybe we'll do just one of these just to, oops, there you go. That's as good as we're going to get, my friends. So those ACs, look at those ACs now and that HP and stuff. Now, if I can level up again, why not, right? But my goal is to kick some alien butt. That is so rude. What level are you? You guys just walking in like he owns the place. Oh, crap. I'm hitting the wrong button. Okay. Alien time. Is this guy like doing something I have no clue he's doing? Like he's that badass? He's just running in there like he can do anything. Oh, there's the medium sized ones. I didn't know there was the uh, other ones because I thought there was only these these ones and the big ones, but that would have been better. I don't know if you can call them medium sized, but one that won't probably kick my ass instantly. I'm guessing the bigger they are, the better drop they have, because these guys ain't dropping crap right now for us. And I was just doing this for fun. It wasn't because, hey, I needed the AI XP, uh, which sucks because you get no alien XP now because of our leveling up. Um, but it was more for the fact that I wanted to be able to kick these guys' butt without dying. And it was more for these guys, right? So, But maybe there's enough of these guys, too, that we can, you know get some more AI XP from them plus get ourselves something going here thank you okay might as well no time like the present right somebody looks like they or maybe that was already happening there I don't know please don't like multiple aggro no I think we're good holy crap he still does so much damage oh yeah You hit specialist. Fire damage, eh? Ouch. These guys are... They're, they're just badass, period. I want to pull them back just in case. That looks actually kind of cool. The, the lighting in the background there. Looks like we're going to be good, though. We're just going to have to be careful, pull them back, kick their butts. And if I can do it without using the first aid ones, I mean, they're not like a big deal. I just, if we can just do the other one, that's even better, I'd say. 
Now, I wonder if there's like a max level to these. I think it must be. Oh. Oh no, there's a level below. Oh wow, okay. Never mind. <gasps> Wait, you're telling me the first one of these guys we got, we got literally what we were looking for? Nice. We already have something there, but let's see. Um, do, 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 do. So brawling two, all offense one. Is this an upgrade? Yeah, look at that. So also I learned that we aren't screwed with these. I thought maybe we weren't getting them. I guess sometimes it's just, hey, you don't get it because whatever reason. But uh, yeah. Is there a wall there? Is that why? Oh, yeah, there is. But this is an upgrade here as far as I know. Um, yeah, so if we go weapon here and weapon here... So what is this, DPS 10 to 13? Yeah, that's a huge upgrade. And you just need piercing, right? Yeah. And they look kind of cool too, to be fair. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you guys have picked on the wrong dude. What well, technically I'm a lady. Lady dude thingy. A dudette. Wait, am I actually crushing him that well? No. This feels like I just became Superman. <laughs> uh, that is awesome. Oh, that's just pure luck, or if I'm actually doing that well now, so. Cool. Now, is this the best weapon for us? Eh, probably not. Is it even worth doing this? Eh, I can't tell you anymore. There's probably something better just leaving the gates, right? But it's fun, right? So non-drop. Oh, look at this. This is a back item. Adds the XP. That was the dock. That's the quest we just did. I did not know it did that. Holy hell. Yeah, let's get those on. It's going to look ugly, but... Oh, yeah. That's awesome. You can still open your bag, like I said, do it in your inventory, right? So... There you go. So, so we got energy weapons here. We can always trade them or sell them or something. I don't want to fight with something like too many things here at once, to be fair. Ugh. I have a feeling if I go for this guy, that guy's coming for me. Oh, yeah. Your feelings have been confirmed. No, we're fighting you. Okay. Oh, son of a... This sucks. I think this is where we're going to have to run. I want to see if I can get these two and then I'll run probably, but I did not want, you know. So this is where maybe leaving the corpses there to rot is sometimes worth it, but I mean, if they have drop loot too, right, I want it, but... As big and badass as these guys are, these guys are pretty badass too, so that's kind of the issue here. We're gonna... here though in a second. There you go. I think we might be fine. Oh, this is getting stupid. They got that though. There you go. We might be able to do this. Actually, I think we're gonna be fine. Unless we aggro more of their their dudes again. Now my mother just came home and she's having some issues. I don't want to go deal with that, but I have to deal with this HP taking so long. <laughs> Come on. Come on, dude. Let's do this. I, I get anxiety, by the way, you can tell. So, because my life is like, oh, you weren't there to help me. Uh. So, that's where my anxiety comes from in life. There we go. Okay, we're going to run over here. Hopefully, not aggro anything. And we'll come back here in a minute. Hopefully, we'll be safe. No, well, we'll hopefully be safe. Okay, we're back. I think it's time for us to get some buffs going here because. I'm sure these are getting a little low. It looks like it increased it, so I'm pretty sure that was exactly what was going on there. There you go. That should be good for now. Um, so 
I was talking to somebody and they suggested poison injector bracelet and range uh, meter that I also can get from the Tonio guy. So we're going to do that a little after. We're going to spend some time here, though. Might as well. And then uh, that sounds like something worth investigating anyway. So it's not like you have to watch me kill these for like 20 minutes. But it'd be kind of cool if I could get one more of these uh, daggers just to kind of match with our set. So we'll, we'll see what we can come up with anyways. Go. Let's go over here. I think somebody. Oh, maybe those are just dead ones. I guess for fun. I was <laughs> like, somebody might have done that, but I don't think so. But the amount of stuff we've come out with this place is actually pretty incredible. Oh, there you go. There's your sword one. Oh yeah, these aren't lootable, so... I'm hoping... Oh wait, can you actually go in here? Oh yes, you can. Hopefully you don't get our ass handed to us, but yeah, you definitely can go in here. You gotta love how it's raining in here though, that's a bit of a... In my opinion, a bit of a bug. Looks like you can't go any further. Oh, here you go. Oh! Find a friend. Okay. Wait. You get this here? Oh, we get NCU. So this is how you can fill up your decks? Oh my goodness. Find another player and fight him or her to your team. Uh, when you are in the same team, use the, nano, uh, use the nano can friendly buff on this player. There you go. So we got to go hunt another player and then basically use this on them. Oh, crap. I'm doing the slow. Is it backspace? Yes. Backspace slows you down. I was like, I don't know how to fix that. There you go. I guess there's a delay from the weather to get turned off. So I guess no matter where you go, indoors, outdoors, whatever, I guess it takes a little bit for it to shut off. Or maybe there's strict zones where it turns off instantly, but like if they forgot to put that in into said zone, then it can carry over and then it tapers off, I'm guessing. Yeah, we should use this on them. Get ourselves some delightful stuff here. Nice. Okay, so we'll take you, and I'm more interested in this thing here. Ooh! We already have this, but let's check out what we have now. So this is the eye, I guess? Eye? Yeah, eye. So we got this one. So this looks like it's all the same thing, but an upgraded version. Yep. Perfect. Cool. Now these are... Are these... No, no these could be traded, I guess, right? Yeah. So they have no requirement. Oh, they do have requirements. Level A. Okay. I was going to say, if you want to keep these or share them or trade them or whatever. See, this is what I think the best way. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. This is not normal. Oh, crap. Please don't die on me, computer. No, it's fine. The game is dead. Okay. I don't know if there's a way to get out of this, to be fair. Oh, apparently the, it, it fixed it for a second and then it, there you go. That's a weird glitch. By the way, my performance is insanely fine in the game, but that's the first time I had that issue, so... Oh, I don't want to expend that. So that might be something else causing that. So shadow here. Oops. So, yeah, use modify concealment, duck, dodge, uh, modify... It. Yeah, so it's just basic. Enable special attack blur, this special target defense buff. Yeah, that's probably a good one to start with. Yeah, I would say that's probably... And then you could go to general perks, potentially. But I think that's a, not a bad one. 
Unless you want to go with one of these ones right away, but... It's not... It's about some of these, like, the perks that they give you later on that makes them interesting as well. So don't just be shocked and be like, well, these kind of suck, because they give you some cool stuff later on. Modify uh, re, uh, regain XP, modify venturing. Huh. Anyways, let's do this one. Let's let's get our first perk here. Oops, sorry. First perk here. For sh uh, that. There you go. Are we good? Oh, holy crap. You spawn fast. This makes more sense fighting this guy because you can just do this over and over. It's almost a guaranteed drop, it seems, so. Wait, you share the same... Oh, that's cool. So I can give him an EXP buff, by the way. I like they have a force, like, go and hunt somebody and, you know, shove it down their throat. Wait, what is not... What? Oh, I'm actually a little confused on that one. Why did that not work? Oh my goodness, you gotta be kidding me. Now here's the thing that'll throw you off more. A level 11, a level 13 we just got. So yeah, look at that. So do you keep farming them and get the highest one? <laughs> uh, you gotta love that. I don't know if it actually changed it out. So let's see here. Oh, it did actually change it out. It just, I guess, takes time. So we're gonna change this one out now. We're gonna put this on over here. There we go. Now we're gonna kick ass with two of these. I mean, that was our goal. We got exactly what we wanted. So I think what we'll all do is I'll probably camp these for a bit anyways. Why not? Have some fun. Um, you know, get other ones here, maybe slight upgrade here and there. Uh, but I think that's pretty much it for these kind of guys. And then, um, yeah, I think what we're going to do, I like the colors of these rigs. I don't know if they're worth keeping. I just like how they gave them some cool colors. And so I kind of want to keep them just for the coloring. I know that's stupid, but... Wait, we had uh, the brute suit. This one looks better. These are they're the same except this one has more stats to it. It adds EXP, max defense, things like that. Where this one does oh, it it also does uh, all offensive is five on this one. Oh, this one's more defensive. This more is well, it has better ACs. I want this on. I'm sorry, but yeah. There you go. We're going to throw you in there. Very cool. Okay. There you go. Are you kidding me? Did it actually replace him with a dumb one? <laughs> it's like we're going to kill you, jerk. Look how much damage we're doing now, though. Okay. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to work on this a bit. Oh, here, 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 here. I want to invite this guy. Um, flight. How do I do this? In flight? In flight. Oh, crap. Did he do? I don't know if he's in the team or not. I might have to find somebody else. Yeah. 
There you go. Not happening. Me no speak English? Ah, whatever. Thank you. There you go. We got it. We got the memories and everything. I'm going to let him do this because obviously he wants to camp here and we got what we came for. Um, so I'm going to head back. We're going to work on that other thing anyways. Wow, look at this guy's actually green for us. I would never have expected any of them to be green anymore. Um, but hey, look at this. We'll ding here in a second. So, And we got our memories here, which is awesome. So we can put those in here, which we probably should. Now, this guy only has two spots, I think. Yeah. There might be another deck we can get. I didn't actually pay attention. I feel like we had picked up a deck at one point, but I think it was crummier. Did we pick up a deck? I don't know. But anyways, that's really cool. So now look at that. We got 30. Oh, we got to put one more in. One more in, punk. There you go. There we have it. So we got, uh, sorry, what do we have now? 38 NCU, so lots to uh, work with. So we're going to go and uh, do these uh, the Atonio quest here, and then that's it, basically. Okay, so uh, when we go back to Atonio here, he has, do you only have weapons and, uh, weapons and weapon upgrades? And apparently he has a bracer, which that's what we want. And then we also want to, um, off you go. We also want to learn the other one. You also have blah, blah, blah. I like the HUD device. So that was suggested. There's also this vest, but I have no clue. Leather vest. I'm guessing it has some good stats to it. Yeah. It's got some run speed, max nano, things like that. But it's not like anything that makes me want it. You know, I'm, I'm happy with what we have. But I guess if you wanted to do that for fun. Uh, but what we want to work on is uh, all this. So basically, I need to kill... Fleas in the junkyard to get more venom samples. Um, I'm going to have to kill waste collectors to get the compression ch chamber. That was that little clear chamber. And then um, after that, uh, we're going to go into the junkyard and kill the 32V dockers. And oh, and 32V dockers again. So basically, it's just everything over here that we've already done. We're just going to kill their kill them even more <laughs> so i'm gonna go and get the parts and then we'll come back and continue on okay so we have to do this what four times at least so let's do that four adaption factories holy crap um and then yes yeah, so we're gonna have to do this so i guess basically you do this and you just do each one of these so you go like this and like this like this and like this and like the what <laughs> blind apparently and like this there you go awesome and then once you've done that uh we've gotten all the pieces together so for example for the bracelet we put you together and you together and we get the bracelet and for the other one um we put in the this guy here, and then we put this guy in here, and then we get the range thing. And there we freaking have it. I think we've pretty much done everything in this place. I'm sure I've missed something, but look at that. Look at the range stuff on this. So if I were learned this earlier, look at the damage we can be doing with that. That's actually a pretty sick item to have. You can't deny that. And it's something that might even last a while. It goes in your HUD 3, something we don't have yet. And then this is a bracer, which I don't think we have any. So poison damage added all of a sudden. So that's pretty cool. Um, and then funny enough, I had a ring and I don't think we got rid of it. That did poison, didn't it? Yeah, poison here. So maybe it's worth flipping the ring around here. 
I don't know how that works. I don't know if like they, you know, get added as an extra or something and it doesn't matter. I don't know for sure. But because that one has poison, the other thing has poison. It just seems smart in my head to stack it up together. So we're heading all the way back up to the landing here where we originally started. Apparently when you're level five, there's Janos person or something up here. And there's a mission they get you to deliver a package uh, in ICC or something. I don't know. Something like that. So we're going to look. It looked like they were... Yeah, I'm not sure. I guess they're around here. Wait, are they in here? Oh my goodness, you could go in here the whole time? That is so freaking cool. It's very dark in here, by the way. That is so cool. Okay, there you go. I guess it's as simple as that. I wouldn't have expected in 100 years you could have entered here, which is kind of funny. We're still finding freaking nooks and crannies, which is awesome. But I think we've overall did most things. I think we can use the word most. I'm sure there's many things we might have missed, some interesting things, etc. But I think overall we can pretty much say we, we did pretty good, I think, now. And uh, we can move on. Um, I was thinking about doing more of the alien stuff, but I know the other guy was over there, and he's probably going to be there for a while, and I don't want to screw with him. So I might take a peek, but more likely we'll just probably continue on out of here now that we're uh, we're finished. Eh, no one seemed to be here, so I'm killing some more aliens. You know, I realized I had this hack library this entire time, and it was an item that we're supposed to put up here. This is the beauty of me just missing things like a noob. I was going through things like, do I need this? Can I delete this? Whatever. Uh, and I just saw that. So that's the package we have to deliver. I don't know if that's uh, anything new. Oh, yeah, that is a new one completely. Cool. So, yeah, I'll work on this and then we're out of here. And that's it. So we're about to hit our next AI level. And then I think we're do done here. Um, I got a nice uh, spirit here, actually. So that was kind of cool. Oh, wait, is it capped? I think it's capped. Did he, or do, are we still like sitting like, oh yeah, it must be capped. I think it's capped based on your level or something like that, or title or something like that. I forgot that was even a feature, so that's all cool. Um, anyways, let's open up our character here. So I just got a really nice wrist. I think it was this one here, yeah. Well, they're both the same pretty much, but yeah. Anyways, look at that. Some more damage and stuff added in there. That was a really nice one, so that was kind of cool. We're filling them in, which is really cool. We still have left, right hand, waist, and feet, but it is kind of cool to slowly fill them in. And then, obviously, over time, they're going to become more and more obsolete anyways as we level up. But um, that's something to worry about at another time. You know, I'm just going to keep, you know, working on that, and hopefully they fill in lovely. Uh, so we're leaving. We're going to go to the exit. We'll see you there. Hey, my friends, I think that is it. We are out of here. So we're going to go over here. I assume we're going to hand our ID chip to this guy here. So here you go. And we hand that in. And there you go. Okay. Looks like we have done it. Uh, I think we've done it. In before we screwed something. Uh oh. What happens when I leave and then hand that in and <laughs> I think I might have like accidentally handed it in and be like, hey, we're doing something bad and then killed my circuit chip. I'm not 100% sure. Wait, there's a machine here. Okay. It's to prevent like accidental leaving. Woo! I had to look that up because I was like completely blown away like an idiot. So. Yay, I've done it. Woo! Boys from the something. Interesting. 
Okay, so we've done that. And then we might as well go over here. I think that one quest, we might as well just get all the quests done, hand this in. Um, I believe this is what we need for um, finishing this one. So it says, uh, is that like EXP or something, I guess? Something bl blessings. Interesting, I'm not even sure. <laughs> Maybe I'm not going on the right play. Oh no, there you go. <laughs> Creepy place. There you go. So we can probably just do this. So now I gotta figure out how to hand this in because I have no clue. I thought it was just simple as click these guys and be done. Uh, let's see here. So miscellaneous, here we go. Reveal walkthrough. So we go in here and we're supposed to talk to the butler. My mistake. There you go. And then we can hand this in here. And there you go. Wow, that was a lot of EX. What the? 51,000 credits. Awesome. And 11K. Well, they gave me a whole bunch of stuff, too. I have no clue what all that is, but hey, that's cool. That is freaking awesome. Okay. Well, my friends, we have made it from there. I've enjoyed that place. Honestly, if it was another episode or two and it was bigger in size or whatever, or more in depth, you know, like little dungeons and caves and whatnot, I would have kept being happy going in there. I enjoyed it. It's kind of a fun part. This is what makes Anarchy Line fun, um, is there's these like dungeon zone type places like that. So the subway, Temple Three Winds, etc., etc. You go there. You could spend a lot of time there, and it's just a lot of fun. Um, but uh, the next way, I guess, is probably the subway. Um, I'm going to bank some stuff, so we need to find... We could just go anywhere here. Uh, Enterprise. I'm just going to check this one out for fun. Well, that's, is that a store? Oh, yeah, it is. I wasn't sure at first. I just want to look for a bank, to be fun honest. Oh, is this the tower stuff? Vehicles, yeah. These are the expensive stuff here. Oh, yeah, look at y Yamaha's. Actually, it doesn't seem as expensive as I remember back in the day. I think you wanted, like, a level 30 or something around there. Vehicle Air 80. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is what people used to try to go for back in the day. It didn't even seem hard to find. And this is for the Tower War stuff. Um, I wanted to look for a bank. I guess they don't have a bank here. I know in the Shadowlands area they usually have one at the ends, but... Oh. Is this just future stuff? What is this? Oh, veteran points. Oh, I think I have veteran points anyways, because I'm on old count. 55. I'm not sure what you get out of it all, but from existing and being playing this for a long time, you can use this to buy stuff. No way I'm buying any of this stuff. Uh, 150 price on it. But you can buy other smaller stuff on here. Probably even a Yamaha. I'm going to look at it later. I'm not really worried or interested in it right this minute, but... Um, yeah, there's some cool stuff there veterans could get. And there's this leader or us. Apparently it doesn't work for me. Honestly, I just came here for a bloody bank. <laughs> building social city buildings. Oh, is this like the AI building stuff? Interesting. I never really looked into this stuff before. The car, furniture. Interesting. There's a lot to this game you wouldn't realize. It's just... I've played this game thousands and thousands of hours, and there's always stuff surprising me. And I've never actually been like end game doing like end game bosses or anything. It's kind of sad, actually, but uh, that's not because of the game or whatever. That's just because of my little pea brain, I guess. Um, let's go over here. I guess there's uh, armors here. I guess there would be a bank there. I just wanted to check out a bank just so I can throw items in there, and then that way, in the new episode, we're fresh, we're ready to go, kind of thing. I don't want to be running around with all this junk. 
okay, I'm giving up on this. <laughs> These are not the kind of places I assumed they were. Ooh, that's so funny. Let's try over here for fun anyways. There's a pharmacy. I know where to get one. We can go to Borealis or whatever, but I just was checking out here and I find that funny as hell. Weapons, pharmacy. Fair trade. Fair trade's got to have one. Even these guys got to have one usually, but... Obviously, I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, there is no banks in these at all. They're like, they're specialty shops. So that's, I think, the issue here. They're not your regular tiny one. They're like, kind of like a full out specialty kind of place. Probably a bad idea to run in here. Oh yeah, we can do our insurance terminal here. That's where we'll respawn next time. I'm going to check fair trade for fun. Might as well. And then we'll just find a bank next time, obviously, if I'm not going to do a good job at finding one now. Yes, this one will have a bank. There it is. Regular shop. There we go. So the bank has lots and lots of space, by the way. <laughs> I was like, how do you find it so you can, you know... It's in that wacky way. It's like you're never going to get there. Anyways, um... Well, that's not going to equip anyways, right? So I guess there's no... I guess I'm just used to... Oh, I want to do this easy, but I guess there isn't. Now, you could do list mode on this, actually. Keep in mind, that might be annoying. You could actually rename bags later on, so this makes life easy as well. I'm not going to worry about that right now, but later on, obviously, organization, running out of room, things like that. I'm going to want to be putting more effort into that. But right now, I'm just going to drag everything in here like crazy and then just forget about it, basically. And then later on, we'll get some bags and organize this. But like I said, that's later on in life. What about you? Uh, oh, yeah, that was the second one. So we don't need you again because we already have you. There you go. When you thought you had it all done. Yeah. Okay. And I guess in the end we didn't need this thing. There you go. I probably could have just bought bags and did the organization, but I'm not really wanting to do that anyways. Eight credits. Yeah. There is a bag vendor here, by the way. Let's see here. I could probably do this off camera and just do this accessories. Oh. So here's a belt. One slot. Just wondering if there's a one better here. Two slot deck. Here you go. Three slots. Computer lit. So you can get this and get better computer lit. You lose some of the bonuses on here, which is what? what just two NCU. So not really a, a much of a bonus here. But you would get three slots instead. So you can get more buffs. So I guess apparently we're going and doing... Uh, Upgrades already here. These are so fast. I remember these used to take painfully slow. It might be depending on the ones you use, to be fair. So I don't know if that'll let me. Yeah, some things don't move while you're doing this, and you can screw it up too, if I recall. Oh, you screwed it up, didn't you? I think so. <laughs> yeah, when you're doing like the long cast like that, you just can't screw it up or you got to wait again. That's what I did. Now we got to wait. There you go. So now we can put the three decks into this one. And now we have 44 NCU. Very cool. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much. Actually, I'll put you guys down here. There you go. But uh, that's it for this episode either way. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, all that fun stuff. And we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.